Hi guys and welcome to my place for a new tour de shelf. So the last time I showed you my complete doll collection. It was at my previous place, so that was kind of a before the move tour. And I still haven't showed you my collection uh, in complete at my new place. And I actually um, waited until now because I finally finished to open all of the box of the dolls that I recently bought. So now everybody is sort of on their shelf or at least out of the box. So I think it's a good time to actually have a tour and show you everything. So let's get started here with the small tulip shelf. So at the top here we have Sage and um, Eloise and Cedric. So I just got Sage and Eloise recently. So you are going to see the review pretty soon. Then on the top shelf here we have Mir, Atsildia, Isolde, Io. So basically my more uh, older dolls and also the rarest dolls that I have. And then you have some of my Mio dolls. So my Taeyang Mio and my Angel and Fraser here in the corner. Then we have Taeyong Soul and the two Japanese uh, dolls. Then if we go down on the next shelf we have kind of the uh, colorful dolls and we also have at the back some older doll like um, Nahato here and Galen is also here and we have Shil and Rovam here so those are like Shil and Rovam I got them like very early in my collection but the other are more recent and then we can go down one more time and here we have so my ninjas and I think my pulip is just lying down for some reasons probably fell during the last earthquake and then we have like little doll here and my most recent doll that I got from the like photo contest so it's kind of my dancers here and we have Nomado because she's playing the music for the dancer obviously and at the back we have my cats so I don't know if you can see the cats over there. Then on the other side of the shelf I have my unicorn. Basically the closest thing to a pulip unicorn you can get because this is the limited edition of Veritas which I actually dressed like that during the workshop at Groove so I didn't like I knew it was a very tough because it's written on her eyelid but I wasn't sure which one and actually that's a tan limited one so that's how I got her then if you go down here we have all my Nendoroids so I just recently opened them so you're going to see reviews of them pretty soon and we have the Mikus so a lot, lot of Mikus and we have my Q-Poch as well so those little things are just here and I think it's really really cute how small they are and then we have the big big polyp shelf so it's in front of the windows I can obviously never get open and it goes down to the floor so that's basically four levels of polyps so let's start here at the top so we have my detectives and you can see Henry and the doll to poor dolls then we have Nina retro memory and the Joannes Ednar, my customized Rosalind and then we have all the steampunks in this corner so you can see Eos, 
Jiro and all the others obviously. Zora is at the front, she was like customized Zora, which I actually got her like black like that. And then we move to the Alice steampunk series. So you have the rabbit here and Alice's. Both of them are in the balloon. And the Taeyang is at the back here with Pluto. And then we continue for Alice. So we have the classical Alice series with a rabbit at the back. Uh, I have a review of the rabbit coming soon. Then you have another Alice, which I only have one Alice. Like, I only have Alice in that series, basically. Then we have some Romantic and Du Jardin doll. So, I still don't have the mint Alice Du Jardin, which is the last that I'm missing. And I don't have the Romantic monochrome either. Then on the next shelf uh, we have so the rest of the Romantic Alice series and the Blue Rabbit du Jardin. They call it White Rabbit but it's really blue. And then we have the Lunatic Rabbit and Lunatic Queen. And at the front I have Isil Duke, Kali and Cassie. Uh, Scarlet is hiding in here. Coon, the girl with a pearl earring, milk tea and milk latte. Milk latte with her big teddy bear. She had her teddy bear from the very start when I got her. Actually, the day after I got her, I got the teddy bear for her. Then we have Alura who is hiding here because she's wearing a yukata at the moment. Then we have Laura and Bloody Red Hood and my Namu Wolf. And then on the other side we move to the Mansion of the Immortals. So we have Valko, Wilhelmina and Verhelmo and Lilo. And then the Vampire, so Nosferatus and Carmilla back there. And my kind of fairy tale stories so you have the bad queen the bad godmother or stepmother and the bad stepmother in disguise and you have um, Gretel and Cinderella Dahlia Cinderella and the little prince with um, that rabbit Amelia and then you have the fox at the back and my Prince Charmings with Akira and Anne is here hidden a little bit as well. And then uh, the third shelf is actually the anime shelf. So you start with the Rosen Maidens. So basically I have all of the recent Rosen Maidens and I have one of the older ones here because she was the one who wasn't remade so I didn't know if I wanted all the Rosen Maiden but I just couldn't resist the twins so after the twins came out I had to get all of them then of course we have the Gothic character and Oscar and the Taeyangs from Koroshitsu G Dal Tweety here and Evangelion dolls. So if we continue here, it's kind of like a little bit more modern style dolls. So I have Shella here because I think she has a crush on him. And Meg. And I have like the new new uh, Nico Nico Mau Mau here. Like my easel basically are in this corner. And there is a doll hiding here. The RTA is hiding here. And then we have Naoko and Koichi at the back. Akemi is hiding here. And my Namu. And then my 
uh, Space Girls, basically, and Canel and Varel and Nana Chan, and of course the Merle, Merle Nostalgia. Like, Merle Nostalgia is hiding here, so Merle Nostalgia, Lear. So, and then at the very bottom, we have also one wearing Kigurumi. So, I have uh, only those two in this series and Paja is here, Moon and at the back we have a few dolls uh, it's a bit dark here at the bottom so we have a few dolls Doll Natalie and Gloomy and then more dolls at the back because the thing is they only the dolls can stand the polyp cannot really stand properly on the shelf, neither can the tie young. So I had to put like my dolls at the back to have them stand there. So all the dolls basically are there, my little monsters, my little musicians. And I have like the more rock and roll style of polyp here. And then uh, we're going to continue a little bit with a different style of music because my Vocaloid stalls are all here. So we have the Miku at the front, all four of them. And then at the back we have the dolls because I can stand, and Mako, and Kaito, and I have a Namu there as well. And then more of my Mio dolls are here at the back. And at the front, I have the very pretty girls. So basically, that's it for this polyp shelf. And then here comes the Azon and Ball Jointed Door shelf, basically. So here I have all of my little fairies, and they are kind of having fun because they're so small that I can actually set them up with some accessories. So they are at the dollhouse and they have like crazy things and a little garden with a big frog and I have like the little animals up there. So my little fairy really have like a good life because they can have the f all the fun with all the fun stuff there. Then if you go down on the next shelf I have all of the Sarah's Alamo dolls. So one is missing here. Her sister is missing here. Uh, you're gonna see her later. So at the front you have all the Mew Mews and my sort of winter girls, Maya, Kiss girls, then some nostalgic story girls, my Alice, Alicia Afternoon Peach Tea. Then you have my new Maya Bakery, which is the last one I actually got. Then you have so all the Twinkles. Twinkles a la mode, the girls are on this line here. And this one, like my kimono girls. And this one is a pink, purple a la mode. But otherwise, all the Twinkle are on one line. And the Happy New Year's here. And at the very back, I have the uh, Sweet Sweet Alamode Girls. So all of them lined up against the wall. And then this is kind of an anime doll that is kind of uh, tall, but you're going to see the anime shelf. It's with my ex cute, so she cannot go there anymore. So then on the next shelf you have all the Kiki Pops. Well, all but three because you're going to see them later. So all those uh, first series Kiki Pops, second series, third series, like all of them basically, except three. The boys, the little Chinese style girls. Here. 
Here is my romantic sugar free. I was looking for her. And then you have my ball jointed doll. So this is my pinky dolls. So so and Miko. And then my blue fairy doll. And then my big boys. And my little USD girls at the back. And then on the last shelf you have all of the X cutes. So the brand new X cutes are here at the front. Then you have kind of my of series so you have the witches that I have here you have my characters so only three characters here so I don't have a lot of characters and then you have like Auto and Utah from the Alice then you have like Cheshire Cat and Rabbit and then the rest of them is the Auto Gino Kuni so you have like all of the Auto Gino Kuni dolls basically are lining up at the back, at the front, and Alice is here too. So this is a uh, Alice Otoginokuni Minami, and the Snow Whites, little princesses, and the mermaids. It's a little bit hard because my ball jointed feet are hanging here. So let me fold their legs up, if possible. Come on, guys. So I'm going to show you the Minami Mermaids at the back here. Let's see, Minami Mermaids. And the Snow Queen, the Snow Queen is just right here. So you can see, those are kind of like the winter girls. Here. So yeah, basically. So, and there is a few missing, so you're going to see them later. So then here on this like top shelf near my, uh, you have Amane, she's the only doll in this shelf and I have Gigi and all my Gigi stuff. And here we have my detective and the Alvastoria kids because there was no space as you could see in any other uh, shelf and they are kind of a different series so I just put them there to separate. So I know you're going to see what I see when I sit at my desk. So I have my teddy bears, my big shark here, and my polar bear. And you have the escapee from the shelves. So this is my Pulip Mini Me with Mini hibari -chan. So Here, Mini hibari -chan. And then you have the Kikis, so that's the brand new Kikis. And maybe this one is my favorite Kiki. So she has escaped when the other arrived. You have this little fairy who is here, Veil, and she has a brand new dress, so that's why she's here. Basically, I kind of uh, keep around the dolls when I change them or when they just arrive, so I can play with them a little bit more. And then um, in this corner of my shelf here, of my desk, you have like the missing cat. So I actually changed her outfit. This is like outfits I got from the um, Lucky Bag Asan store. So I changed her outfit to be grey pink, which is really good because she has some grey stand and she's like a blue cat, but kind of grey too. Then we have the Winter Gymnasium Kids. So I took them with me because I changed the other one with the new outfit that I have. I thought they were the same, but they are actually a little bit different. And I also have my Momonita doll and another Utah which just got changed so basically that's it guys so guys I hope you enjoyed the little tour uh, if you want a review of any of the doll I have shown to you today just let me know in the comment section below or any other places basically and I would make that uh, video for you basically so that changed a lot from where I lived before. Uh, I have a lot more space, but it's still like very difficult for me to keep the shelves empty. So you can see that I have like a lot of dolls back up on top of each other. I live in a very like small place, so that's why I cannot have like 
a big huge wall who is dolls one by one next to each other which would be so awesome but anyway I kind of like uh, the atmosphere here around the house and yeah so don't forget to uh, give me your comment like this video and subscribe to my channel I hope you're having fun and see you next time for something else thanks for watching bye